five paper crafting tips and tricks for you today. Um, today I wanted to talk a little bit about the metallic foil doilies. They are an amazing new product that just came out in the catalog and they come in two different um, finishes, gold and silver, and two different sizes. So they're super handy. And I'll show you how I use that on a card here. Just as the, the focal point of a card. Isn't that cute? They really add a lot of bling and kapow to a card. I used it on this banner as well. This is actually a little cake topper banner that I made for a baby shower. Isn't that sweet? I absolutely love this. I just love banners. But I used the metallic foil doilies to really make the letters pop out from the banner since it's kind of a busy patterned banner, very vintage look there. I used the doilies as a, a helper to make the banners pop out. Just a quick note on how to make the banners. We have a brand new punch called the, the Triple Banner Punch. And depending on the size of your cardstock, it will make banners in up to three different sizes. Absolutely love that. And it's just literally as easy as sliding your cardstock in and punching that banner end. And you have your perfect little mini banner there. This would be super cute on a scrapbook page too after the party's done. So there's an idea for you. Now I love those doilies just the way they are, silver and gold, very useful, but I also really enjoy um, changing the color so that they're useful for, on other projects too. You could use it just plain white like that, or you can just take any marker and quickly and easily change the color of the doily to match your project. So that's what I did on this one. Isn't that cute? I used this um, pink as my accent for this black and white card and I changed my doily to be pink as well. So it gives it a really elegant look. That's more of the timeless elegance papers. Just absolutely love those. I'm all about vintage. Now a way you can save money with these doilies is to use them cut in half like I did on this project. Where I only used half the doily and then I saved the other half for a different project. So that was easy too. And this is a, a layout you can use for this card if you don't want to cut out the scallop on the lace. You can just use a pink piece on top and bottom there and get a very elegant look as well. So there you go, three quick ideas, actually four, oops here we go, four ideas for using metallic foil doilies in your crafting. And I hope you've enjoyed those tips today. Now turn off the computer and go get in the craft room. Thanks for watching. <laughs>